Fucking hell, there's quite a few new people here. We just hit 1100 subscribers. I can absorb if I want to, if I don't, then rules will die. And then I'll leave Jack on satellite 5, he'll probably cry. Oh, Hello there, people of the universe. My name is Mike Sfy, and we did it. We raised, we set out to raise 250 quid for the Mental Health Foundation on the 1k 12 hour live stream. Basically, I said that once I hit 1000 subscribers, I was going to do a 12 hour charity live stream. And I did that on, well, Saturday just gone because it, it's it's a Monday morning. Hopefully this is going to come out. Uh, I'm going to schedule it for about 7, 8 a.m. Hi, welcome everyone who's already been on the channel who I really appreciate and then all the new people who joined from either my good friend Will's community section on his channel he left a post advertising this thanks my dude but the saving grace of the stream besides the regulars and besides the person who came from Will's channel was the good few dozen people who came from the one and only Pewdie PewDiePie subreddit oh you don't know PewDiePie oh um he's, he's a YouTuber he's been doing it for quite a few years now and he's the most subscribed creator on the planet no friend and fan of the channel the watcher 5569872.48011 that's a joke he basically put this in the PewDiePie subreddit and even though it was insulting my Minecraft skills it definitely brought a lot of traction to both the channel and the charity live stream so not only did we, did we raise 375 pounds which is way past the goal but we also got to 1100 subscribers and that is honestly amazing and hopefully each and every single one of you who joined the stream from will or pewds i hope you're here now and i hope you're watching and i hope you realize how fucking scary it is for me to say oh where did you find mike's vice channel oh pewdiepie subreddit what but i digress it was it was a chance and the fact because when i asked i asked kaya to share it on reddit i didn't mean there so the fact that he did thank you and most importantly the fact that so many of you took a chance to come here not just for the stream which is amazing the main goal of that stream was for the charity and we smashed our goal completely we nearly raised 400 pounds that is fucking amazing and whether you donated 5 10 15 20 or that one fucking hero who donated 100 no matter what you donated or if you shared or if you just sat and watched and laughed at me the fact is you showed your support i know obviously you might think oh i didn't donate how did i support because you were there on the stream watching in support of the cause yes it's a shame you might not be, you might not be able to donate because a lot of people did want to but you, sometimes you just can't. I'm rambling. I'm scared. There's a lot of new people here. I don't want to let you down. When I upload this, I want there to be a lot of comments from people I know, as well as new people, because I want you to stick around. The fact that you gave me a chance for a stream, and instead of just staying for the stream and then leaving and being like, oh, great course, thanks, see you later. No, you click subscribe. Some of you join the Discord fan server, and I'm hoping now you're going to stick around for new content because I haven't uploaded in over, I think, three weeks now because after a convention I went to at the end of July, I had, like, a bit of a down segment. Video started slowing down, and that wasn't going to happen, so I thought, you know what? I'm allowed a break, and that's what I've been doing for the past two weeks. But nevertheless, I'm back. Videos are back. It's amazing, and as I... No, I'm basically going to... Manage actually before we do hopefully people don't mind me showing we're gonna go through all the donations my friend Lucy my mum Mr. Raw my friend James Ash acting animagus Jonah Hunt Kaya anonymous all the fucking organization at least they don't it's charity uh, Royal Kaiju Connor Sruti who is one of the new people who jo joined the channel uh, Ash donated five again Blue Lock Chris Eccleston maybe Jack Kelly, Max Keynes, Kynes, Corono, yep, Corono, I'm calling you that now. Um, Jack again, Freddy Hoodoo, Foo Foo Beasley, ooh, ooh, ooh. Alicia, Anonymous again with 50 quid. Fucking hell, they really like my channel. And then Cartwheel76 Williams, uh, Anonymous again, Jacob Anonymous. That's gonna look weird on a birth certificate. And then Chris, Kirsten Reese at the end, so I know I said Kristen, but yeah, Sorry to cut me short there, guys. I was about to show you me donating the money on stream, but for some reason, the money won't go out till the 25th of the month, which is Sunday coming, so that's really annoying, but I'll be sure to tweet and leave a community post on the channel when the money actually goes out. 
And as a final thing, as you can see here, the total raised after fees is £363 or one pence, which means that GoFundMe, for whatever reason, takes an £11, £12 fee. But saying that, we're losing £11, but we're still we were we are still over the goal of 250 by 113 pounds, which in my opinion is fucking amazing. And as I wrap up this vlog, I just want to go on again about how grateful I am for everyone who came to the stream. Not just for those who subscribed and are hopefully gonna stick around for the videos. Yeah, that is amazing. But the main point, the main point is how many people came out in support of mental health awareness. For my first charity live stream, I wanted it to be something special and close to my heart. I I was going to do it for cancer research because Stefan Koss, Stefan Sun, who Robbie Rotten, the meme, he passed away sadly, he lost his battle. Many amazing people have lost their battles with cancer and that sucks. But then I started thinking about Robin, Robin, Robin Williams and the fact that it's personal to me and the fact that I battle it. I thought whilst cancer is still important and I will definitely do a charity live stream in the future where we donate for that, I'm going to do loads over the coming years, I promise. But for the first one I thought it might be... There might, it might be a nice hook for the audience if the charity I'm donating for is something I sadly deal with and can relate to because thankfully I haven't dealt with cancer. I don't know anyone who has dealt with it and I don't really, I don't know, I don't want to, I don't know how to word that sentence without in case I come across as insensitive. But my point is, whilst cancer research is an amazing cause, I figured for my first one to make it special to the channel, because that's kind of what it is, doing this and everything is pushing the channel forward, so it is special to the channel in a way, I figured it should be something that relates to me, it might, I don't, I don't know, I, I, f I just thought it was a good idea for the first one to do that. And overall, I think it was a great success. I'm very happy with the turnout um, in terms of donations and I'm also very grateful for everyone who has joined the channel. Obviously that isn't what the stream was about but I can't look a gift horse in the, I can't not look a gift horse in the mouth. I am very grateful for how much the channel, the fact that we, we went from 1043 to 1135. That is amazing. This channel has had a bad habit of whenever we reach a milestone, people, fans, trolls, um, more, more than often, more often than not, it's trolls that unsubscribe because they like seeing the number go up and down, which is a childish, th childish thing, but I suppose there's no harm in it. But there are times where people are doing it to cause harm, and we hit 1,000 subscribers 12 times. But thanks to everyone's amazing support and just the traction the channel was getting, we reached 1,100 once and I really hope that this is the next stage in the channel's life. I am definitely going to do more charity live streams in the future. I don't know when the next one will be but I will definitely be doing more but as well as that focusing on just the channel now if you don't mind me doing so. I feel very motivated, very pumped up. I'm out of the little rut but as well because I knew I was going to get out of it anyway as well as being out of it. I'm ready to go uphill straight away because I've got you guys here, I've, like, new and new and current people watching. I've got a, I've got a duty to make content. I want to make content, and I honestly can't wait to start uploading videos again. I'm going to be working on two different series of Minecraft. Um, I can't continue the, the from where the last episode left off that I uploaded months ago because the save is now gone, and that's horseshit. And I did play on stream on the Windows 10 version. I made a little house with a nice design roof, which I'm in fucking love with. But I've decided for the series on the channel, I'm going to start a new save on the Java version. So what I did on the stream on the Windows 10 version... I'm not going to be carrying that on. I was going to, but I thought, you know what? For the series, I'd rather start from the beginning because I'd rather have a video of me playing from the beginning where there aren't moments of people going, you're using the wrong fucking item. And then on top of that, I am, I don't know when, I don't know if I upload these around at, the si around at the same time or weeks in between. I don't know. You guys can tell me how often you want to see either of these series. The second series will be me playing Minecraft with my friends, multiplayer, both on Java. The reason... For the main series being on Jarvis because once I've done all of it and I'm happy with it, I might have my friends join me in my house or I might have fans come on. I don't know. I kind of feel like the Java version is the main one people are playing. It's the one most people have. And I don't want to do really well on the Windows 10 version and then be like, oh, I've got an idea. We'll have fans come on and see my world and da 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 da. Oh shit, they don't have the Windows 10 version. And you might be thinking, Michael, if both these series are going to be on Java, just do one series with your friends on Java. And yeah, that's a great idea. But for some people, they might prefer the idea of it just being me on my own. And as much as I love my friends and I do love playing Minecraft with them, I do like the idea of it being me on my own 
with you guys. You'll be there with the friend one as well, but I feel like with me on my own, it's just me playing, just me talking to you. And on top of that, the next video I will be uploading is a video I promised to upload if we reached our goal. Well, we more than reached our goal, we smashed it. So I'm going to be uploading a video that I made back in 2009 when I was a little boy. It's uploaded on a channel that I don't use anymore because I ain't got the fucking password. I shared it with a friend of mine who I knew when I was about that age. And he forgot the password and didn't get me. And I couldn't delete that video and shit. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm going to upload it later on this afternoon. I'm going to schedule it for 5pm tonight. So two videos in one day. Although this is the better video. Trust me. Please. Lots of stuff to, lots of stuff coming, lots of exciting things. If there are any things you want to see me continue or games you want to see me start, let me know in the comments. Obviously, if I don't have them or can't afford them, then then bear with me. I'll work around it. We'll do what we can. But just please suggest what you want to see me do on the channel, whether it's something I need to buy or it's a current series or it's something I've stopped playing, what you want to see me go back to. Obviously, obviously if I don't want to, then I won't. But... I, I, with all these new people here, and of course the current subscribers, I kind of want to get a feel for what you guys want. And as much as I like entertaining the current lot, with the new people being here, I want to make sure they stick around. And in fact, no, scratch that statement. I want to make content what everyone enjoys. Everyone enjoys so much that they interact with it. They leave comments, they like it, they share it on they share it on Twitter, or they just share it in general. Because with the new, with the traction to the channel, I feel like the channel is finally going on the up that I've wanted for so many years. I feel like we are going to be able to maybe reach 4,000 subs by the end of the year. And you never know, we might, because we're already about halfway, quarter way through 1,100. You never know when 2K might come. You know, you, I don't know these things. I don't want to be over ambitious, but then again, that's what I've always been doing, so I'm going to keep doing it. But as I wrap this vlog up, because I can hear it in my voice, I'm sorry that I was stuttery. I'm sorry that I'm a bit nervous. I just feel like the channel is finally going into the spotlight. And again, there's dreaming it, and I've dreamed of, dreamed of some stuff like this for so many years, but there's dreaming of it, and then there's it happening, because I think this is what that is, and that scares me. But... I'm going to slap my face, slap myself in the face, turn off slow mode because I ain't no bitch. And I'm going to try my absolute hardest to make great content for current subscribers, new ones and newer ones who hopefully will come in the next coming weeks. I don't know. Would it be amazing if we could reach 1,200 in the next week or two? Yes. Would it be, would it be amazing if we could get... 800 likes on this video, I'm not saying that to be cliche, like, oh, 10k likes, no, I, I don't know if I can say, oh, yeah, let's aim for 700 likes, 200 comments, I, I don't, I don't know, I don't know how this video is going to be received by current fans, new fans, fans that might come to the channel because new fans have shared, I don't know, I'm nervous, I'm going to go, this is the first time I'm doing my outro in about three weeks, if you don't include the, the, the live stream one, but yeah, last thing, I'm so proud of all of you for donating, sharing the stream, sharing the donation, watching the stream, being there, everything. I won't name names because I'll forget someone, so I'm just going to say every single person. You're amazing, I can't wait for the next stream, and I can't wait to see where the channel goes forward now. Where the channel goes forward with content next. That sentence didn't make any sense, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please remember to leave a like and a comment, and of course, share with your friends as it really does help with the channel. Subscribe if you are new, and as always, I'll hopefully see you all back here next time. Bye.